Well, hello YouTube and welcome back to Retired for Life. Yes, the little mystery wall has been open and thank goodness there is a cement foundation at the bottom of this. For some strange reason they dropped it down before the corner and then it went around the corner. So that's fine. But it was still pretty flimsy. So what I've decided to do was frame it out a little farther with some 2x4s and then add a couple of pressure treated 2x4s to the bottom and then some 2x6s on top of that. Now that's going to make for a good sturdy piece of wall and that means that I can basically put my screws anywhere I want in this as I put my boards on. So it's a relief to see that there is nothing catastrophic here. Just a little bit messy and we'll get that cleaned up. But I've got to admit, I was a little bit disappointed that there were no stashes of cash or gold, as was suggested in a couple of the comments. Oh well, what are you going to do? So let's get going. pressure treated. Well, I think that's going to be a little more solid than this. Well, it has again turned out to be blasting hot and it's going to be that way for a few days. So I'm going to put up my canopy here to give myself a little bit of shade. Well, it's just the perfect day to wear a dust mask. Oh my. What I want to do is give the soffit boards a light sanding in order to prep them for stain. It won't take much, but that dust is just going to be dropping straight down into my face, so I've got to do something. And of course the wasps have decided to pay me another visit. Oh brother.
I want to get these soffit boards all stained before I start putting up the house wrap and the board and batten boards. Well, we're making progress. We got things cut in. Man, it is getting warm out here in the sun. So let's get into the shade. I've taken a page out of Dell's book here. Well, I hope you guys have been enjoying today's video. And if you have, I'd really appreciate the like, and I'd love to have you subscribe to the channel. And don't forget, if you got any comments, suggestions, anything like that, I'd love to hear from you. All right, let's get back to work. Oh yeah, that's better. Plan, Dell. Thanks for the hint on that. I'm staining these horizontal boards that run along the ground now. It'll be a heck of a lot easier to get them done first rather than trying to stain them when they're down at ground level. These are five quarter by six pressure treated deck boards.
I was a little short on the length from my house wrap, but the piece I just cut out of the window worked perfectly to finish things off. So we've got all of our house wrap up. We've got all the seams uh, taped, reinforced around the edges of the windows. That's a big step. We are actually ready now to start putting the new siding up on this wall. That's gonna be so nice to have this old stuff gone and good properly installed and solidly installed siding on this face. Well, that has been a hot couple of days. It's really been something. And another barn burner today. So I've got my nice little cooling station set up here. I've got my battery power pack and my big circulating fan, which I will plug in very shortly, uh, which will help keep things comfortable under here. And that will be a nice spot to be able to retreat to. Uh, that has... Uh, that's making a big difference to be able to step out of this sun and get cooled off. But for now, that's gonna be it for today's video, folks. So the mystery door situation has been solved. Fortunately, a very easy fix, and we are moving ahead. So as usual, if you've got any thoughts, comments, questions, anything like that, I'd love to hear from you. I try to get back to everyone who leaves a comment or a question and answer them to the best of my ability. And I always pay attention to comments and suggestions that people make and often implement them. So I really appreciate that. So thanks very much for watching, folks. Remember to stay safe out there, be good to each other, and we will see you out on the trails the next time. Whew.